Greg, take you, Heather. To be my wife. To be my wife. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. As your husband. As your husband. I promise to faithfully love and serve you. I promise to faithfully love and serve you. In plenty and in want. In plenty and in want. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I make this covenant before God and our family. I make this covenant before God and our family. To love as Christ commands. To love as Christ commands. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. Heather, repeat after me. I, Heather, take you, Greg. I, Heather, take you, Greg. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. As your wife. As your wife, I promise to faithfully love and serve you. I promise to faithfully love and serve you. In plenty and in want. In plenty and in want. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I make this covenant before God and our family. I make this covenant before God and our family. To love you as Christ commands. To love you as Christ commands. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. You know, for those who don't know Greg, he's uh, a very uh, genuine person. He's very hardworking. He's very sincere. Um, he's also, I gotta say, my kids ask me, they're like, Dad, who got in trouble the most when you were younger? And of course I have to confess, and I'm, <laughs> I'm like, it was probably me. Um, I just want to say, you know, I think I'm speaking for everyone in this room that uh, we're for you, and we uh, are for your marriage. We are for you guys and your family, and we'll be praying for you and with you, and we'll do anything we can to help you in whatever you need. So I honestly can't help but think that this day and this beautiful marriage and this beautiful couple was definitely ordained by the Lord. And I know, Heather, it was a long road for you. And I know, Greg, it was a tough road for you, but I believe that the Lord is making this a beautiful road in your marriage. So we love you so much, and we're so honored and thankful to be here to honor you. Love you. We wish you the best. We love you. We wish you God's blessings and trust in the Lord. We'll be there for you anytime you need us. We, you know, we're only four and a half hours right away, right? I don't think so. That's close, so. But come and see us, you know, we want you to come and see us once in a while. We have a farm now, we can, you know what we can do down there. So we love you, God's blessing on you, and we wish you the best in the future.